Actually, are you plowing now? What's up and welcome back everyone. Today, it's snowing. New invention's gonna be hard at work today. Nice. Pretty slick, huh? Yeah. <laughs> it's the little things in life that get me excited. Got your shovel here. Freaking sweet. All right, guys, so what we're doing is basically we've got one, two, three, four accounts that are 24 7 facilities, um, like old folks' homes or like uh, government centers or, or like a government establishment library and then the other is a couple like care centers for homeless people or elderly so they're open 24 7 obviously it's a sunday people are going to be visiting people so we want to get those cleaned up um get that stuff taken care of we're gonna go through open everything up we've got a couple more inches of snow coming and um so we're not going to get that's coming down pretty hard. My foot is soaked right now. So we're not gonna get terribly detailed just because there's gonna be cars in the way at this point. Um, and I don't, you know, so is what it is. We're gonna get the main accesses opened up. Uh, we're gonna get the sidewalks done up. Any liability points, things like that. Oh, we got a Walgreens that Zach and the Magners are doing. Um, yeah. Are you recording this? No. Turn it off. <laughs> Alright guys, for all of you that are wondering, um, don't ever bring your girlfriend with plowing. <laughs> you end up actually losing money instead of making money throughout the event. Also, wanted to shout out Hantho Outdoor Services, keeping her clean over here in Maplewood. A little bit strange, I thought. They're actually from Rockford, which is probably, in this conditions, I'd say at least all of an hour away. It's kind of ballsy, I don't know. Seems like a long way to go. Uh, we got one site cleared up, and then we are headed out to the next now, to the library. Chase and Ashton should be there. So, let's rock and roll. Are you plowing now?
there's actually quite a bit of snow. I'd say we probably got three inches, four inches right now. This place opens at 10, I believe. Oh, it opens at noon. Nice. Um, can you be really careful? But if you want, can I, let me, let me plow first. I'm gonna plow first to get no. this started. Yes, I'm gonna plow first. Get yes. in or get out. No, I'm gonna plow first because you don't know this lot and I just wanna get the curbs exposed so you can kind of see where everything's at. With how white it is out right now, it's hard to see definition and where it's at. Down in the comments, who likes the new 6.7 better or the 6.0 from last year? Blows up. I've got a lot of comments from people saying they like the 6.0 better because it sounds badass. I think this truck sounds just as good. The only problem is I don't need to give it as much throttle to go anywhere. So you never get to hear like how cool it sounds. I need a tune that like makes it with less power. Right, guys so just uh, at a road here we plow um, I wanted to show you guys it's a gravel road but look here it got warm the last weekend and it got super icy out here super icy out here you can see here like these ruts this is all like way divoted down so basically what's happening is when you're driving you get sucked into this icy rut and you turn the wheel all the way and you can't turn out of it you can't like do anything because this is just straight ice out here so the reason I'm showing you this is we're gonna tell the HOA here we are going to salt sand it or just put rock chips or something on it. That's not an option, it's gonna happen. Um, I know a lot of these places are always trying to save a buck or two, but basically what we're gonna do is tell them like we are going to be doing this. This is unsafe conditions. It needs to be done, right? And I just wanted to share it with you guys because don't be afraid to show people or tell people that it's an unsafe condition. Like it has to be done no matter what. Like you're the one maintaining it. Don't be afraid to be assertive and actually tell them like you're gonna do it, you're gonna charge for it, it is what it is, it needs to be done. So just wanted to share that with you guys because this is literally, I've been doing this for like five, six years out here and I've never seen it this bad. I mean, it is just straight ice under here. It is like uncontrollable. It's not like we have bad tread on here either. So give you that update. I got two bones. Can you hold One foot of plug and one foot of load.
Alrighty, righty. That don't make any sense. All right, chugging along. 352, Rezzy's pretty much wrapped up. Chase and Colton are finishing them up now, and Dad is in the skiddy. And then in a couple of hours, oh, I left the door open when I grabbed the camera out, shoot. Um, in a couple of hours, after businesses close, it is Sunday, so most of them aren't open, but once the 24-7 facilities, I guess they're not, they're not closed, but they slow down after dark. We're gonna head back over to those, detail them up, clean them up, make them look good, and go from there. So we'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, well, what's up you guys? I'm just cutting in real quick. Hope you're enjoying the video, but if you haven't already, please you guys subscribe. It, uh... What's up you guys? Just cutting in real quick. I just wanna thank all you guys that are subscribed to the channel and support the channel. Um, wouldn't be able to do it without you guys. And if you aren't subscribed, pipe 350 Chev driving by. <laughs> and if you aren't subscribed, make sure you guys go down below, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. Really helps with the YouTube algorithm. Um, you guys are the reason we do the videos, obviously, so appreciate all the support. Make sure you guys are subscribed. All right, let's get back to it. 